Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Dan here, Ultimate Boston Red Sox Collector page on Facebook and YouTube videos. So um, I got one item in the mail today, and I'm very excited about what it is, no matter, no matter what it is, I guess I should say. Last Thursday, I finally sat down, and with the help of Mr. Scott Spaulding, and I want to give you a shout out, Scott, because you've been really supportive of my channel and really helpful. Uh, Scott had does a lot of through the mail autographs and had actually mentioned the site that he uses uh, to get addresses and to see successes and failures and things. So I, I decided last Thursday I needed to get going on this and I signed up for the site and I sent out, um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, five requests on the 16th. So that was last Thursday when I mailed them out and got one back already six days into it. Now I didn't open it up. I don't have any idea who it is. It's one of the five that I sent to. Hopefully it's signed, but I'm really excited about that. I wanted to save it and open it on camera because um, again, this is gonna be a surprise to me as well. I'm gonna open it carefully because sometimes they, I've heard they include notes. So this is just a card, but it is Mr. Bob Montgomery. Beautiful card, beautiful signature, Bob Montgomery. I put a little note in there and told them how much I enjoyed um, watching him as a kid as an announcer he was ned martin's sidekick uh when i was growing up watching the red sox on the old wsbk tv 38 um, any of you new englanders out there probably remember that station or at least if you're close to my age i'm 46 so if you're in the plus or minus five range you probably remember that but bob montgomery was a great color guy he was ned martin was kind of bland but bob montgomery was a really good color guy um so this is a nice card. It's a 75 tops card. It's the first card I found of him when I sent. So nice turnaround. I think Montgomery's living in Boston. That's where the postmark is on the envelope. I'm pretty sure that's where I sent it to. So I'm super thrilled about that. My first TTM in a long time. And hopefully this is going to be the start of something really successful to branch out yet another. Now, something I thought of, unfortunately, after I sent these five is um, a couple of months ago, probably maybe less than that, I did a video... Uh, showing my autographed index cards and I'm not going to get greedy with sending out through the mail requests because I feel like a lot of people send out five six cards of the same play to the same player I'm not looking to sell them or trade them or I mean maybe I could use them as trade bait with other Red Sox collectors but I feel like this is something I'm I want to do for myself and reap the rewards of my work for myself so maybe that's selfish but I don't I don't know um you know, it, it costs a dollar ten in stamps to do this. The envelopes and the scrap paper that I use in the printer labels and everything else is pennies. So, and I already have the cards, so I'm not having to buy the cards. So I think it's a it's for a, a roughly a dollar twenty five. I can get a, a a real autograph, and I can tell that's a beautiful big autograph in blue sharpie. And Montgomery can't be young anymore. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look at his birth date here. He was born in nineteen forty four. So. He's 76 years old. Um, he celebrated a birthday on April 16th. Um, so he's he's not young. He's 76 years old. I didn't need to have five cards signed by him. I wanted one. And um, I had considered maybe trying to, because a lot of players from this era that I wanted to send to, guys that are getting up in age. But uh, I'm happy with that one. So I'm, I'm super, I can't stop holding it up. It's, it's you know, this cost me $1.25. And I did it on my own. And I'm, Kind of proud of myself for finally getting getting that into motion and i definitely hope to continue that aspect of my collection i have a case right now that i put my uh, through the mails in and if i do this like i hope to and i'm as successful like i hope to be i'm gonna fill that case in probably a month so i'm probably gonna have to look at an, an alternative storage option so a beautiful 75 tops bob montgomery my first ttm thank you again scott spaulding um, definitely has been extremely helpful to me um, and his videos have inspired me to do the through the mail thing and I will go on the site and update it and put a put a message board that you know six days and most people that I saw that I sent out to were within 10 days so I'm, I'm optimistic and I'm hopeful that I'm gonna get a lot of the other ones back I did send out five total I've got uh, a couple more that I've got ready to send out tomorrow so I'm gonna maybe try to send out Anywhere from two or three to five a week um, to people that, I've, that are known successes and that don't take a whole lot of time. 
um, to get started. And then maybe what I might do is branch out every once in a while, find somebody who maybe takes a little bit longer, but does sign and maybe send some of those out in the, in the midst. So I'm really happy about that. That's the only thing I got in the mail today, but I'm, I'm ecstatic. It's like, I got a huge card tomorrow. As I mentioned in my video last night, I'm taking a trip down to Portsmouth, New Hampshire to pick up an item from somebody that I'm getting at a really good price that I'm super excited about. And I can't wait to go get it and get it home and get it set up and do a video on it tomorrow night. So um, I'm super excited. And I want to thank everybody. I, I posted a three-part video last night showing some of my renovations to my, to my rooms. And I got some really super comments on those. I've been seeing them pop up. Um, this morning and, and constantly during the day today. So I want to thank everybody who did comment, took the time to watch those videos. Um, and uh, I will be hopefully getting back to the, your comments and, and checking out some more videos. But uh, I may do another small video later tonight. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm still contemplating. I guess we'll see what I get accomplished uh, later on today. Got a couple more jerseys I want to get uh, set up and, and put into cases and get hung up. I just got to figure out where I'm putting them. So that's my video for right now. Thanks everybody for watching and enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. Take care, everybody.